Hey guys, Tomboy601, and it is a patch notes day, baby. And well, I will say this patch notes kind of short. We know a lot of what's in it, but I think it's still going to be a decent update. So we're going to go through all of it. Then we'll uh, give out a code that's going to get you 12 free holiday camos. So if that sounds good, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and let's dive on in. First things first. Let's talk about the thing we know is coming, the holiday event, the, the end of year event this year, the made up currency that we will be grinding and cutting our teeth to get is ice crowns with them. We will be able to purchase the premium battleships, Ohio and Annault or Anhalt. And then along with two of the geysers, uh, Lady of Cold and Queen of the Deep. Commander guys is additionally, there will be holiday collection 24 crates. We don't know what's in them, nor the drop rates on them. Usually these are the interesting crates. The ones where like, I'm not going to say you come out ahead because do you ever really come out ahead when gambling, but, um, these tend to have some fairly decent drop rates, uh, within them. Additionally, uh, during this event, wind roses during the, in, the entirety of the event, you enjoy a five X first win bonus for all of your ships. Which, uh, hey, that's always nice. Get get those, get the grind in. Cool. That's that's the holiday event. We, we've we talked about Ohio. We've talked about Anault, Anault, Anholt, Anault, Anholt. Either way, uh, fun ships. Uh, we don't look, it doesn't look like they are giving any sort of uh, Ministry of Balance updates with these patch notes. Of course, these are pre-release, so they may change that. But uh, there doesn't seem to be any buffs. Anault was a fun enough ship to begin with so i'm excited to see it come back and ohio well it's uh montana cross with georgia and uh should be a ton of fun next up we have the advent calendar uh if you complete the advent calendar which i feel like is just like all the other calendars we've been having but hey we'll take another advent we'll take another calendar you'll get the king of winter guys so another uh guys and guys Guys, guys, um, you know, I feel like you've probably heard my stance on the guys is I could really care less about them. If you like them, hey, it's cool. They're giving away a free one. If not uh, the advent calendar, there are a ton. There's usually some pretty good rewards in the advent calendar. So uh, be sure to keep up and play for all the days. If you miss a day, it'll end up costing 100 doubloons to unlock it. Cool. Next, the thing that I like didn't realize I was going to call, but I sort of called the United strength campaign, the campaign ship. It is a legendary ship. And uh, remember I was like, man, I miss the good old days of Minotaur being the campaign ship. Well, here comes a new legendary ship. Brisbane is coming to the game. High fire rate, solid concealment as well as repair, as well as a repair party and radar. I E guys, um, if you're unaware, Brisbane is a Minotaur, is a radar Minotaur with HE. That is just what I want you to picture. So uh, Minotaur Hull, it's not a ship that actually existed. But, hey, we have a new legendary tier ship. I'm happy. I'm happy. Like, I was like, man, I miss the days when they, when they gave us a legendary tier ship in the campaign. And here we go. We have a new legendary ship in the campaign. Um, as far... Uh, other things going on during this update, uh, the holiday traditions collection. So we are getting a new collection set of collections. If you remember earlier, uh, we had the collections for, I think like the Japanese Navy, I think it was. Um, but we have new, we have new collections. And if you manage to complete this collection, you'll get Enrique Gabolde W. Cool. Um, early access as we covered, uh, yesterday, two separate lines coming into early access, both French heavy cruisers and the German alternate destroyers, uh, both of which do look interesting and uh, I can't wait to grind them out. Um, we'll, we'll just have to see how they come in. Um, it's not listed in the patch notes whether it's going to be through crates or through like early access bundles or what. So we will have to wait and see as to how they are handling this early access, but I am happy to see we are getting some early access. Next up, winter ships of the update. Uh, we saw those teased as well during uh, one of those trailers. The tier six premium battleship Nelson, 
the tier seven premium cruiser Kutuzov and the French tier five premium Juprat will all be in the store. Um, and then Gabaldi, as we mentioned above, could be achieved by completing the holiday traditions. Last kind of big thing for the update is the new map. It won't be called Killer Whale. It will be called Can Scandinavia, and it will be for Tier 5 and higher. So, hallelujah, we're getting a map for the upper tiers. I'm excited for that. Um, the only other kind of interesting bit that we should probably talk about is that uh, uh, John Fisher will be added to the possible drop rates for the commanders, which is excellent. If you don't remember John Fisher, he was the uh, British heavy, the British battle cruiser commander who is like tailored to the battle cruisers. So if you didn't manage to complete that calendar, be sure to uh, pick him up this update because he is absolutely worth it. So with all that said, what do you guys think? Like I said, I don't think there's a, there's, there's a lot in this update, but it also feels like a very concise and short version of the patch notes um you know lots of ships i'm happy to see that we have the new ships coming into um into early access i'm really happy to see we're getting another legendary tier campaign ship and one that presumably will be made of explodium um and yeah i think i think we'll just have to wait and see how bad this grind is hopefully it's not as bad as yoshino was last year but uh, we will just have to wait and see on that. And uh, if you want a guide on that, you know where to find that. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. As always, guys, I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day. But before we do that, we have a code to give away. Don't worry, I didn't forget. So if you go over to wowslegends.com slash code redeemer, you can type in the code CH5M9DJHTC. Once again, that's gonna be CH5M9DJHTC. And that's going to be over at WowSLegendsCodeRedeemer.com. Guys, hope you like it. Enjoy the rest of your day. See ya.